Hey Leo, how are you guys doing? Thank you for being here, my darlings. So let's get into it. Let's see what is coming to you in love. Keep an open mind as these are general tarot readings. Um, anything I am saying here could be planned out from either of you's perspective, your person. Okay, so let's see what we got. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, what is coming to Leo in love, please? What is coming to Leo in love? Mm -hmm. What's coming to Leo in love? What's coming to Leo in love, Leo? Okay, Leo, so you have the Ten of Coins, the Page of Cups. So some of y'all, I'm getting that um, whoever this person is, you could have a history with them. You may have known them for some time. Maybe this has been a long-time friend. Uh, maybe this is a friend of the of a fa of the family, okay? Maybe you met this person through your family, or you could meet someone through a family member, okay? What's coming to um, Leo in love? But I do feel like if it's not like that, you guys have, I guess, have history like that with one another um, as a relationship, then this may be someone that you've known for a long time. Yo. Um, this could even be like in past lives, too. It doesn't have to be um, necessarily, you know, in the waking life. <laughs> Let's come into Leo and love. Tell me more. Okay, you have the Nine of Cups. I'm thinking that this may even be someone for somebody that you've been talking to for a while. Okay. Um, maybe you guys have been friends for a while. You have the Eight of Swords. But I feel like even if you guys have been, like, talking for a while or something or, you know, you and this person haven't been, um, you know, maybe you guys have been friends for some time or something. I do feel like someone has romantic feelings here that they want to express. Okay? I'm getting your family could introduce you to someone new, okay? Or their family and you are the new person in this person's life. However, it resonates. This is a pretty interesting reading. What's coming to Leo in love? Tell me more. Um, I'm getting some of you could have a crush on on a family on um someone's family member. Okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is such a weird. This is such a weird um reading. Hmm. I'm also getting for some of you could be celebrating um, the birth of a child or a pregnancy announcement. Okay. And if it is a pregnancy, it could be a girl. The star. Um, maybe dealing with a Pisces. Cancer, a Scorpio, an Aquarius. Now, if none of those situations apply, Leo, I'm also getting that perhaps this is someone that you have a crush on, you're interested in, but there could be a third party, okay? And uh, maybe they've been with this person for quite some time. But I do feel like I'm getting something strongly about someone having a crush on somebody. So, Leo, if you can go ahead and just comment down below and help me make this shit make sense here. Um, the sun. But um, if you suspect someone has a crush on you, they do. Like, let's say, um, hmm. let's say this could even be a f like one of your friends. Like, maybe you think your friends like you, or you think your friend's friend likes you, or you think your um, 
love interest uh, cousin likes you I don't know it's just it's it's a crazy reading but I'm getting something very specific from it <laughs> um wow that's interesting but I do feel like someone has a crush on you someone has a crush pretty bad crush on the other person but at the same time, the Eight of Swords is like, I don't know how I should. Someone's like, I don't know how I should respond to this. I'm getting for some of you, Leo, maybe your person, like somebody, like your person's, um, I don't know, someone that, that knows someone else is interested in you. Someone who knows your person is interested in you or something. This is really weird. <laughs> Eight of Swords for Leo in love. But I feel like there's thinking like I don't know if I how I should respond to this or if I should go for this um I can't necessarily say that it's mutual just yet um the devil Capricorn and justice I feel like someone doesn't really want to do something wrong the ten of pentacles keeps showing up okay so Leo um someone could like you that you suspect likes you okay but it's crazy the circumstance is a little bit tricky um, wow, okay, even if it's not, you know, any of these scenarios, I do feel, um, that whoever you're dating right now, I feel like they're dating you or, you know, they're interested in you long term. It could be starting off as a friendship. It could be starting off, yeah, as a friendship or something and, Maybe you guys have been friends for a while, okay? But I feel like maybe this person wants to start off as a friendship with you, okay? It's a general reading, guys, so I try my best to help as much of you as I can. Okay? So... Take whichever situation you feel resonates, but moral of the story, I do feel like there's a crush going on here. Someone really likes the other person, um, and whether they're dating or not, or third party or not, uh, I think that someone really, really would like a shot, a chance. Um, I feel like the feelings are really, really strong, okay? And there's this feeling of, you know, you're my best friend, and like, marrying my best friend or really liking my best friend or something like that maybe you guys just feel like best friends with one another but it's more of just friends it's something lurking beneath that there there's love here between you guys it's not just friends okay is what i'm getting and i do feel like they want a relationship with you leo they do but maybe they want to just start off as friends but just know it's not just friends they want so you see what i'm trying to say it's tricky it's tricky <laughs> Uh, Page of Cups for Leo in love. Page of Cups. What is this? Page of Cups. Okay, okay. See, you guys could be friends, but they have feelings for you, Leo. It's not just... And I do feel like someone wants more than friends. Okay. Um. Yeah, somebody may want this to be exclusive and not just friendship anymore. This thing, Ten of Pentacles, keeps showing up. Tell me about this uh, Nine of Cups for Leo and love. So I would say don't underestimate. This person has... I'm trying to figure out what's happening here. This person's feelings are so intense for you. Whoever this is, whatever this is, their feelings are really intense. The feelings are intense. Again, I can't... It could be mutual, okay, for some of you. It could be. Um, it's supposed Maybe you're wondering if you should have that talk with this person, if you should confess your feelings for them, um, or vice versa. But man, I think someone here has so much feelings for you, Leo, and um, could be an Aries. You could be an Aries with a Leo placement, maybe, okay? Someone has recently, someone has fallen for you or they've had like a crush on you for a long time. Um, they've watched you. They feel like you are their nine of cups. You know, they have hope that maybe one day you guys can be together. Um, this person feels like you guys have amazing chemistry. They love how they feel when they're with you. Okay. Um. 
they I feel like this person feels like you're the holy grail. Um they love the connection that you guys share. And um the the most the takeaway thing here that I'm getting is that um someone feels as though like this is my homie, my lover, my friend type of thing, you know. <laughs> yeah. So don't get it twisted. No matter how this person's acting with you, Leo, they want more than a friendship. Um, and for cross watchers, if you're watching for Leo, no matter how this Leo acts with you or whatever the situation is, whether you guys are friends right now or not, they do want more than friendship. Okay. They could be overthinking it, but they do want more than friendship with you. This Leo. Okay. Guys, this was such an interesting reading. <laughs> Let me pull a few more cards, Leo. It's coming to Leo in love. Yeah. Um, somebody really sees something real, something tangible here. They they really do want more, okay? Okay, so, yeah. This person could want more than friends, Leo. That's what I'm getting. This is someone who they're trying to be patient um, with you. But ultimately, honey, this is what they want. And um, I don't know. For some of you, there could be a third party or something. Or maybe this is just a good friend of yours. Whatever. But yeah. I do feel like someone's going to be expressing their feelings soon. Page of Cups, Ace of Cups. They're literally going to send a message or whatever. Tell the other person how they feel. And then we have, then it goes to the Eight of Swords. Like, hmm, I don't know. Um, seven of coins, frustration, ten of swords, wanting something to change here, or the fortune, yeah, wanting a change. Yeah, this person's frustrated because they want more than friends with you or whatever. Um, wow. This person's been feeling you for a minute. They feel like it's destiny. It's coming to Leo and love, Leo. All right, gossip. They could be talking to friends about you. Maybe they talk to your friends about you. Or it does. It does feel like someone else may know about their feelings for you or something. Uh, they talk about you a lot to other people or something. Okay, this is an interesting reading. They have a lot of passion for you. A lot of chemistry. They feel. Um, sure, woman, Leo. Money, Leo. You know, young female, huh? Okay. Could be long distance communication. And then we have um, Ice Queen. Okay. Wow. Well, Leo, in case you didn't know, someone definitely has it bad for you, um, Leo. Yeah, I'm very attracted to you. Very attracted. Uh, the answer is yes. So if you're wondering if the person you like likes you or they want a relationship with you, they do. And uh, future proposal, there will be some kind of um, happy with you. It could be some kind of, uh, someone's worried here. Okay. It'll be some kind of proposal here. Um, like, hey, can we be more than friends or something? Now, if you've been in a relationship, for my Leos that are in a relationship and you've been waiting for your person to pop the question, I feel like they will pop the question. Maybe you've been together for a very long time and you're just like, look, when is it going to happen? It's going to come as a surprise. They're going to they're gonna um, surprise you with this, but I feel like it's something that's happening soon. Okay? Yeah. Interesting read, Leo, uh, but please uh, let me know down below how you feel this resonates for you. I feel like someone you didn't expect to have feelings for you has feelings for you. You, you probably didn't expect it, though, is what I'm trying to say. Um, maybe you just thought you were friends or... So you will have an offer, but it's not from the person that you thought um, or vice versa. Maybe... Okay, you want to give this person an offer, um, but you don't know if they want more than friends with you or something. Okay, I do feel like they do. You have unfinished business. 
Leo. Roll the dice, taking a chance on the truth, confession, clarity, reveal, and secrets, healing. Okay. Reconciliation. All right. This may have been a hookup even as well. And um, yeah, you guys could be friends. A friend could have a feel a feelings for you, Leo. Okay. Um, someone that you just hooked up with, divine timing. Um, maybe someone was ghosted or something. Wow, romantic feelings though. And it's unexpected. So, like I said, um, someone you're on the Someone you're definitely not expecting, bro. I'm telling you. To have friends for you, have I mean feelings for you, has feelings for you. Or maybe it just wasn't confirmed just yet on how they feel. But you're definitely about to find out who this person is exactly. Okay. Wow. Anyway, <laughs> it, it started off kind of strange. It, it did start off strange. Um, but yeah, so that is what I have for you, Leo. I hope you guys enjoyed this reading. I hope it gave you uh, clarity. Thank you for being here with me. Um, talk to you soon.